dance, and there's beauty in a bushman who is just taking a chance. There's defiance in his soldier who is fighting with his brother, and there's truth in his love for his spiritual earth mother. His manner mild and gentle, and his eyes keen and kind. But it's hard to guess exactly what is going through his mind, because he carries few possessions to describe or to express, and with no fixed source of income, and of course, no fixed address. He keeps an honest journal, though it holds no thoughts or fears. It's built of solid facts instead of poems and ideas, dates, times, stops and starts, the miniature of his days. I guess Swaggies find comfort in many different ways. Yeah. And Swaggies find company in many different camps, though few would share the lifestyle on the road that he tramps. And it's fairly fair to say that Swaggies don't always impress with no fixed source of income and, of course, no fixed address. But a husky mm. chuckle starts the tale and a husky chuckle ends and the poetry in between is a way to make amends. For he brings the words to life like few others that I've known because he lives the words daily and he lives the words alone. They're words that shaped a country and they shape a person too and Campbell surely offers up a unique point of view and what a great home for a poem in a swaggy's heart and dress, with no fixed source of income, and of course, no fixed address. It's written by... Oh, that was beautiful. Oh yeah, right so Andrew, 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 Andrew Hull, 2004. Yeah. Oh wow, that was That was written in 2004, magical. Campbell. Wow, 20 years ago.